Hello all, welcome to this session. In this session, I'm going to answer one of the Selenium interview questions. That is, how do you handle untrusted SSL certificate in Selenium WebDriver? Let me answer. First of all, what exactly is this untrusted SSL certificate? There are some web applications, okay, which give this kind of errors, okay? So let me show you them first. If I open this URL, this example or sample URL in the browser like this, you will get some error messages saying your connection is not private, your certificate got SSL, certificate got expired or whatever it is, okay? So, and also here, if you see here on the browser, it's saying not secure. That means this application, that means this application doesn't have any proper certificate. Okay, it doesn't have any proper certificate, secure certificate, which do the encryption and decryption on this website. Whatever the activities that you are doing on this website, okay, need to be transferred between the client and server machine. Okay, so but during that transaction or while this uh, transaction is going on, the communication is going on between the client and server. Okay, so it's not secured. Okay, the hackers can steal your information. That's a problem. Why? Because this website is not okay having any secure certificate a secure certificate need to be installed which will do the encryption and decryption for us okay so that even though the hackers steal your information while during the transit of the information between the client and server machine hackers won't be able to understand because those information will be in encrypted format like credit card numbers okay or whatever it is okay passwords they will be encrypted during the transaction between the client and server okay but here this website doesn't have any secured certificate inst installed okay so that we call it as uh, untrusted ssl certificate since there is no certificate it's untrusted okay so the website is saying https okay here s stands for security or ssl okay ssl certificate okay s stands for ssl but th this website doesn't have ssl certificate that's the reason you are getting this kind of page instead of getting the actual page you are getting this kind of page okay you are not able to go to the page but still, during automation, despite of this application doesn't have a proper certificate, secure certificate installed, even though it is an untrusted or uh, SSL certificate, okay, there is no certificate or untrusted SSL certificate. Still, I want to go to the page, web page, okay. I want to overcome this this problem and uh, get on to that, okay. And I, I would like to take the risk, okay. I would like to take take the risk. I would like to still go to the website page. Okay, even though there is no secured uh, certificate installed or this is untrusted SSL certificate. How to handle such kind of situations during automation? For that, here I'll switch to this Eclipse ID and I'll simply copy this URL. First, I'll open directly. I'll run the script directly. It will open the Chrome browser, maximize the browser and it will open the application URL in the browser. Once the application URL gets opened in the browser, you'll get this kind of same kind of uh, thing, okay? Nothing different, but we have to handle it. Let's run it. By default, it will give you the same message. The connection is not private and all the stuff. Just see here what's happening. Your connection is not private. Okay. Your connection is not private. So it's not no secure certificate is installed. So how to overcome this in Selenium automation? Further simply here, create an object for the Chrome options, Chrome options options, because it is Chrome driver, Chrome browser, we have to create an object for the Chrome options. If it is a Firefox driver, we have to create option for the uh, object for the Firefox options like that, okay, depending on the browser. New Chrome options like this here, right? And hover the mouse on the Chrome options and uh, import it from this okay now say options dot here the command is there that is options dot set accept insecure certs okay options dot set accept insecure certs and set it to true accept we have to accept the insecure certificates and still move forward and these options you have to provide in the constructor if you don't copy this con uh, options uh, for which uh, to accept the insecure certificate is set to true to this Chrome driver, then it will not be applied. Okay, now it will be applied. Now run it. This time, 
let's see what will happen here we are getting some error let's see okay i'm taken to the home page of this website by overcoming that problem okay fine the script is working fine okay we have accepted the chrome options and everything is working fine okay so simply close this and this once there's no error actually okay fine so hope guys you understood uh, how to handle untrusted uh, ssl certificates in selenium web driver by setting the options to set accept insecure certificates as true okay then we can handle the untrusted ssl certificate so that's all for this session thank you bye bye